today we're doing something different so on my channel I like to do styling videos normally I like to share with you like how you can style your matching set different ways or how you can style your loungewear different ways how you can even style your t-shirt different ways basically I always choose clothing piece and then I will give you some styling advice but in this video I thought it would be fun to do something a bit different so I thought for this video rather than I share with you how to style like a clothing piece I thought it would be fun to start a new series where I show you how you can style your bags so in this video, I'm going to share with you how you can style your Marc Jacobs snapshot bag in five different ways. I've also already done a review on this bag and I will link that in the description box as well as here in the video. Okay, so now let's start with the bag styling session. Okay, so this first outfit has definitely some type of vibe. I really try to make this outfit cozy, chic, and comfy at the same time well cozy and comfy it kind of is the same thing but you know what i mean like it's like you know comfy but i want to look cool at the same time that is this vibe so i paired the mark jacobs bag with a crop hoodie i'm pretty sure you've already seen this hoodie in my latest haul if you haven't watched that go and watch it i'm gonna link it down below as well as here in the cards it is from H&M and it is super super cozy and yeah I just love it and I paired that crop hoodie with a cycling short and these are such comfortable cycling short they are from H&M again and they have like this ribbed texture on it super comfy to wear and to top it all off I actually paired the whole entire outfit with some comfy fluffy sandals i think comfy fluffy sandals are so cute and i don't know why but this outfit is so adorable and cozy at the same time and the pink of the sandal matches perfectly with the pink on the bag especially from the strap so yeah that was the first look for the second look, I wanted to do like something girly and something sporty at the same time and I thought this is such a cute look and that I will definitely wear. So I actually wanted to wear this super cute girly top that has like puffy sleeve and ruching in the middle with some jogger pants. I'm pretty sure you've already seen this jogger pants again in my H&M haul. Super duper comfy sweater pants, jogger pants, I mean. And I don't know why, I really like that contrast like of baggy and girly, super girly pink neon top uh, on the top. I don't know why I find it such a, like a girly, sporty look. And to make this outfit more sporty rather than girly, I actually paired the entire outfit with some Fila Disruptor shoes. So what I like about these Fila Disruptor shoes is that, first of all, they're super duper comfy to wear and they have like these orange accents which complements really really well the Marc Jacobs bag. In my opinion, when you want to style the Marc Jacobs bag, it definitely is an accessories to make any kind of outfit look super, super sporty, but it is like sporty chic and sporty fashionable since you have like these gold accents on the bag. I love this bag so much. I've had it for now a couple of years and it's my honestly my go-to bag. I love it. It's super fashionable and if you love fashion and you think this is a bag for you, I definitely highly recommend. But if you are into classic bags, maybe this is not the investment for you. So I'm the kind of girl who really likes fashion and being, you know, just have fun with fashion and that's why I bought this bag because it adds so much pop of color into any kind of outfit. Okay, so for the third look, I wanted to do something more neutral and I was thinking of someone who much prefer to wear neutral pieces but still want that pop of color with this Marc Jacobs snapshot bag and so I put a cream top like so I've had this top for a very very long time it is a rib crop top that is cream that I paired with these leopard skirt 
um, for me leopard print is also a very neutral print I mean I know it's not for everyone but you can definitely replace this skirt with a more neutral colored skirt you can go with like a cream skirt and because the bag is such a like sporty feel I paired this entire look with some gold sneakers these one are from Voile Blanche and I think if I'm not mistaken it is an Italian brand but the name is actually French so I'm kind of confused or is it French Italian brand I don't know but they're again super comfy to wear and the gold of the shoes it complements the gold hardware of the bag okay so for this fourth look I wanted to pair two of my favorite things together yes two well two of my favorite things together it is puffy sleeves with dungaree skirts those two together I don't know why I am obsessed it creates like this girly cute fun look I don't know I, I think the pairing is really super chic because like you have like this puffy sleeve on the top and then your dungaree goes into an a-line and so it creates some kind of like hourglass shape and it makes you look cute in my opinion so this is the t-shirt that you see in the video and so the sleeves here are puffy and it is from this like organza material and actually this t-shirt is from the Zara Kids section and I am a petite woman and I love love finding cute pieces at the Zara Kids and they're cheaper and they fit me quite well so if you're a petite lady and you want to find some cute stuff but the Zara adult is a bit too big definitely highly recommend for you to go and check out Zara Kids because I have like pants and jumpers and rompers and even t-shirts from them and I style it with some of my like adult brand clothes and it goes perfectly together so yeah I paired this really cute fun t-shirt with my old trusty dungaree jeans I've had this pair for a very 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 long time I bought this on sale at H&M like what, five years ago maybe and I wear it constantly I think you've already seen me wear this so many times on my Instagram it's crazy um, I love this I'm actually looking for a similar jean uh, dungaree dress in like a more neutral cream look and I don't know I just love dungarees I think it's so so cute and to make again that look a bit more sporty I paired it with some Converse so these are my trusty old Converse again I've had this for years and if you've never bought some con Converse I would definitely highly recommend for you to check them out very comfortable to wear I have them in a kind of high top style and these are like very classic and yeah, I don't know. I like to pair my dangarees with this. Again, I hope you like this styling. And to add a bit of fun and that pop of color where your Marc Jacobs bag and everything looks like put together, fashionable, and super cute. Okay, so for the last outfit, I wanted to do a bit of a, like a color blocking moment. I thought it would be fun to pair this blue stripey shirt with that orange Marc Jacobs bag fun fact I actually bought this shirt as well as that Marc Jacobs bag in Seoul to have it a bit of a casual feel I paired the shirt with these high-rise jeans from Stradivarius and I kind of like the vibe because it has a bit of like a distressed vibe in this why do I always say vibe do I have another word mm. Probably not, but yeah, these denim shirts are super cool because they are distressed and they look a bit like, you know, cool. Wow, I really can describe clothes so well. Subscribe! So yeah, to have it more of a laid back feel, pair them with some black flats with gold hardware these are from gucci's i seldom wear them because they are slightly a bit too big on my feet but i definitely need to wear them more often so yeah definitely need to wear them more often the gold hardware on this 
shoes actually matches perfectly with the gold hardware on the bag and so that's why this look is super cute chic and has like that laid back feel also you can change those shorts into jeans if you want i posted years ago a similar outfit on instagram um with some jeans and the outfit looks also super cute and chic at that time so it kind of looks also super cute and chic now so yeah, I hope that you've enjoyed this super fun styling video. Let me know in the comment section if you want to see more of this type of video. I'll do probably a how to style like my Dior vintage bag next. I think that's like my next video that I want to do. So please don't forget to subscribe. Also click the notification button and I will see you next time. Bye.